What is going on, guys? Grave here today. Let's talk about the Modern Warfare 3 Season 1 Free Access. It says play Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 for free between December the 14th and December the 18th. Drop into a variety of classic maps plus the new Season 1 meat map, uh, three ground war maps, war mode, Modern Warfare zombies, and more. When it comes to some other things that you can kind of experience in this in the free weekend, um, you can, like I said, experience that new Season 1 map meet. Of course, you can play Zombies. It says Slay the Horde in Modern Warfare Zombies. It says War Mode, Operation Spearhead. Uh, all supported maps and modes that will be available in this. 6v6, Core Maps, Terminal Rust, High Rise, Shipment, Afghan, and Meat. Ground War Maps, uh, the Power Plant, the Military Base, and Resort. Also, for Core Modes, you'll have Team Deathmatch, Hardpoint, Domination, Kill Confirmed, Ground War. Uh, the playlist, Rustment 24-7, so that's going to be Shipment and Rust. War Mode 6v6 Mosh Pit featuring High Rise, Meat, Afghan, and Terminal, and Ground War. And of course, that Modern Warfare Zombies that we just talked about. It says, purchase Modern Warfare 3 today. It says, enjoy the free access period. Consider Considering purchasing Modern Warfare 3 today for the first time in Call of Duty history, the content you earned in the Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 will carry forward, of course, to Modern Warfare 3. So, if you have not purchased Modern Warfare 3 and you decide to do, go ahead and do that, I'm sure most of you know all that stuff you have from Modern Warfare 2 will carry over. The Modern Warfare 3 free access, like I said, begins on December the 14th at 10 a.m. Pacific Time and ends on December the 18th at 10 a.m. Pacific Time. An additional download is required to play. Of course, it says check your platform for details on file size. So we are getting this free weekend kind of early this year. But I think it's probably uh, something they want to do timing-wise because when the game first came out, there were a few issues. I will say Sledgehammer is putting a lot into this game, fixing a lot of stuff uh, compared to what we saw last year in Modern Warfare 2. So they're doing a really good job, in my opinion. And I think since it's getting close to Christmas, they're trying to get a little bit more hype around the game to get some people interested in maybe purchasing that game for the holidays. Anyway, guys, let me comment with your thoughts. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.